Hey guys, what's up? And today I'm going to be showing you how to install ComputerCraft for Minecraft 1.6.2 or any update higher than that. It should be the same and uh, don't blame me if it's not because I don't really decide that. That's all up to the the Minecraft developers or the developers of the mod. But um, yeah, so basically what you want to do is go into the description of the video and uh, under downloads you should see these two links and you just want to click both of them and it should take you to here and here and basically for this link it should be computercraft and you want to look for downloading and installing and you just want to go down until you see download computercraft for whatever update you're on and uh, if you're installing for an update higher you want to make sure that this mod and microforge are both updated Microforge is usually really quick at updating, so that will definitely be updated. But make sure the mod's updated, so make sure it says for Minecraft, whatever version you're on. If it's for a lower update, then it won't work. But basically, for 1.6.2, you just want to click on that link. And it should be downloading straight away for Google Chrome. It's right here. And uh, for, I don't know, whatever up other ones you're on. You just want to go to your downloads and uh, then you just want to drag it to the desktop or anywhere you can see it and open it. And uh, then you're done with this link so you can exit that off. And then you should be on Google. No, sorry. Well, and uh, then you should be on this link. So Minecraft Forge and uh, where it says select Minecraft version, you want to make sure on this drop down menu that it's on your version. So don't. Don't do that, just do your version, so 1.6.2. And then you want to look for latest whatever update you're on, and go across until you see installer in these brackets, and you just want to click on that link. And it should take you to AdFly, and you just want to wait 5 seconds, and skip the ad. And uh, you just want to press keep. And drag this to the side and you just want to look for microforge wherever it is in your downloads or down here and you just want to drag it to the same place where computer craft is and drop it there so now on your desktop or wherever you should have microforge and computer craft okay once you've got these two you want to make sure you have a program called winra and uh, this will be in the description and basically what it allows you to do is to open Java files and uh, basically edit them and stuff like that. But uh, what you want to do is you want to double click on Minecraft Forge installer and this is really easy it does it all for you but you want to make sure you're on install client because we're not installing it for a server or extracting it and um, you want to make sure that on this link that it ends with roaming slash dot minecraft and uh, it doesn't matter about this this will be different depending on your pc but you want to make sure that it's going into your dot minecraft folder and then you just want to press ok and uh complete it so that's basically part one you've installed the first thing and now you have to install the actual mod so press ok and then what you want to do is make sure that minecraft is closed and um then you just want to open any folder, doesn't matter. And uh, where you see this blank space here, should be a long bar. That didn't sound right. And um, you want to just click anywhere in this long bar. <laughs> and uh, you just want to, it should highlight this thing in here. And you just want to delete all of that. And then you just want to search percent app data percent and make sure it's exactly the same. I'll put a um, text on the screen so you don't get it wrong and then you just want to press enter and it should take you to here and you just want to go look for dot minecraft and if it's not first it should be but you just want to search for it just dot minecraft and then you want to go into that okay and uh, this should bring you to here so this is like your directory and you want to go to versions and basically you want to make sure that there is the 1.6.2 forge folder and that just means forge is installed so you want to make sure that's there and once that's there you just want to go back and you want to 
open Minecraft, so just click on your Minecraft launcher. And uh, in this profile tab, you just want to go into Forge. So go to this drop down and Forge. And uh, basically, now you're running the profile of Forge, and you just want to click play. And this will just uh, install Forge, basically get all the files. So you should see some new files in here. And uh, if you have this mods tab here, that means Forge has worked and stuff like that. So you just want to quit the game now. And uh, a new folder should be generated and it should be called mods. And you just want to double click on that. And basically you might not have that. That's just uh, another mod. Uh, you just want to highlight computer craft and drag it into here so just move to mods and basically that's it uh, there is another thing you have to do but that's all in game so basically you go into minecraft now and uh, basically this forge version now has your mod installed so you want to go edit profile and just rename this to whatever you want just something that will remind you that computer craft is in it so just I don't know I'm just gonna call it computer craft and then you just want to press save profile and go to this drop down and make sure you're on computer craft and then basically um, as I said earlier the good thing about the new launcher is you can easily just go back to the normal Minecraft so just go to 1.6.2 and that's the normal version of Minecraft and then if you want to play with your mod you just go to computer craft and uh, that's basically it so if we press play now as you can see it should say five mods loaded and if you go to mods as you can see computer craft and all this information and stuff and if we go in game uh, let me just make a new world because I'm not sure what happened there okay and as you can see it worked and uh, hey guys and uh, sorry about that sudden cut um, when I went to full screen my recording sort of crashed Anyway guys, uh, thank you guys for watching, uh, if you have any questions or things I didn't go through well enough, just comment, and um, if this mod didn't work, uh, just comment, I just said that, but um, yeah.